And she just took care of business, bro. Yeah, I got a hundred dollars right now. I got a hundred dollars. <laughs> this is insane. This is insane. My question is, wait, pause. How does he know your address? Yo, welcome back to the channel, man. I hope you guys are all doing well, taking care of yourselves as always. But today we have a banger as always. Actually, no, this one is actually crazy. This one is actually fucking crazy. It says, actually, it's better for me to not even describe what the title is. I haven't watched this, but it's better not to read the title because YouTube might be on their period. Let's just watch this shit. If you're new here and this is your first time watching the channel, bro, make sure you actually sub up if you enjoy what you see. If you don't, do the exact opposite. And uh, yeah, let's see. What are you being she <laughs> What? Man, I remember living in a place like this. I really do. It was one of the best times and the worst times, I guess. Actually, I can't even say that because I was a kid, right? Or at least I was younger. So at least when you're a child, you don't sit there and have to stress and, and think about the bills and everything surrounding your living situation. I'm talking about to all my people that have lived or are living in a, a low income area. As a kid, you don't feel it. As a grown up, you obviously do, right? But bro, I can remember all the times I was playing outside with Nerf guns with all the homies we were playing football and stuff man damn i remember it like yesterday bro that's besides the point let's see oh it's these two <laughs> that's the negative side that's the negative side i was just talking I was just talking about all the positive memories. Yeah, this right here can happen and did happen. So uh, that's obviously fireworks going off uh, to the YouTube staff. That's that's literally fireworks. It's definitely not somebody shooting in GTA 5. But basically, these those two girls obviously tried to rob her and her friend. And she just took care of business, bro. Let me see. Is there anything else? <laughs> what? What the f bro, what is the hold on look at this a nosy ass bro So let me get this straight. Why would you ever peek out or open your door if you hear fucking gunshots outside? What? See. It's just the way he peeked out. Look, I, I'm sorry. I gotta write this back. Look at the way he just peeked out and peeked back. It's like a it's it's literally half a second. It's a miss Look, look, look out <laughs> Yo. you know what's funny you know what's funny the person that just peeked out everybody that's living in this neighborhood right now is you guys might think they're scared or they're terrified nah 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 if they're used to this this is like a holiday to them the reason i say that is because bro that's when your rent price goes all the way to the fucking floor and plummets, you bro, you get to basically live there for free. I'm obviously exaggerating, but yeah, this shit right here. <laughs> oh man, I'm talking about this as if it's like actually a good thing. This is obviously fucked up, but yeah, this is how rent stays down, man. It's, it's crazy. I mean, what can I say about that besides well done um, to to the girl defending herself? And that's that's another thing, and this is obviously a prime reason why. I personally feel like, and I will make sure that the women that I care about and just in general should always be armed and it n doesn't even necessarily have to be a gun. I'm talking about armed with either knowing how to defend yourself physically, right? If you don't know that pepper spray, knife, anything, because it's not just weirdos nowadays. It's dumbass bitches like these two who tried to rob them and it just turned out to be the wrong person, wrong time, bro. What can I say? All right, let's move on. What in the crackhead is this? Man, I got a hundred. Pause, what is, let me know in the comments right now, are you opening your door to a fucking 50 year old bald man in the middle of the night? I don't think so, what is this? Man, I got a hundred dollars, they motherfuckers after me right now. The voice, 
the voice is this isn't even just a deep voice this is literally a fucking smoker crackhead voice i we're three seconds in could be wrong but bro right here smokes pot crack meth something he smokes i just i don't want to intrude you but i'm too motherfucking high i'm trying to come down yep yeah yeah i got a hundred dollars right now i got a hundred dollars and, and i want some of that shit a lot of it a hundred dollars more man i give you 150 you can have a fucking card damn man don't leave me out here dog i'm fucked up okay this is sad and obviously i don't advocate and i totally condone doing drugs bro especially if you're retarded because there's a difference between like i know people that smoke weed and just they do it re like recreationally like it just you know what you're doing bro you're not a dumbass with it you're not even if you're an addict i feel like there's two levels right there's an addict and there's a fucking crackhead and that term is not just used for crack it's for all kinds of shit this is what i'm talking about for you to be outside in the middle of the night with no shirt on i don't know if bro is even I don't even know if he has fucking clothes on, bro. Basically half naked begging your dealer for more drugs is <laughs> This is insane. This is insane. My question is, wait, pause. How does he know your address? What? Where? Whoa, I thought he had fucking ass cheeks out, bro. Pause. Pause. All right, that's the end of it. Listen, I never sold drugs in my life ever, and that's a good thing, and I'm very proud of it. I've also been invited. I can't even tell you how many quote unquote friends I had, and 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 people that I knew that literally at points begged me to come with them to these uh what's it called like like house parties maybe i don't even know what to call it basically it's where a lot of them get together and just smoke do drugs and that's just not the kind of person i am bro that's not for me at all i'm against that and i never did it here's my point right to all my people that are involved in selling this shit how and why <laughs> Do you allow this to happen? The how is, how does this person know your fucking address? And why would you give them your address? What? That's not just how you get caught. That's also how you get harassed like this, bro. You have a fucking demon, devious, ultra-leveled crackhead on your fucking doorstep at 3 a.m. in the morning. That just doesn't sound like fun. All right, we got one more video. And this one, this one has no title. It just says, the way my soul would have fled my body. <laughs> it's a five-second clip. Okay. <laughs> Yo, I'm not even in the fucking video and that Loki just jump scared me. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, pause, pause. I have, okay, I'm not proud of this, but bro, I freaked out. Okay, I don't know if I should say this, bro. Listen, it's normal. Oh, fuck y'all. Yeah. I freaked out and I've had jump scares when it comes to, to bugs before. So let alone a fucking bear. Oh, hell no. You don't understand. My boy closed that door way too slow, man. He was way too... Holy fuck, that shit would have did something to my soul. I'm not even gonna lie to you. That would have took a piece of me out. Bro, I, I'm not even exaggerating, bro. I would not be the same person, bro. At all. A fucking bear as soon as you open your house door. Insane. <laughs> That's insane yo i don't know why man but these animal videos always end up being some of the best clips to end off at. the last three clips that i can think of off the top of my head that lion one this shit the coyote one it's always just some crazy ass shit i don't know man i'm gonna end this right here though i hope you guys enjoyed like always if y'all did y'all know what to do bro run the likes up sub up all of that and uh take care of yourselves man i don't say that for no reason bro i'm talking about drink a lot of water stay fucking healthy hit the gym get your money right bro keep your mental cool see you on the next one peace out